so this week is a pretty exciting week. I mean, it's a Monday and there's a video going up, so it means one thing. It's the drop. But there's loads of awesome new games being released this week. There's also new consoles being released this week. And it is just crazy, crazy times. There's going to be so much to kind of delve into that it's hard to make the video to pick just a few games to kind of mention and stuff, but we're going to try. Now, before anything, if you guys are looking to pick up a new controller, and if you play on Xbox, these controllers are still compatible with the new Xbox, make sure you check out Controller Mods. They do full custom, full modded controllers, and they are such an awesome price. They come with a dominator button to make your gaming so much easier and accessible that you got to take a look. There's a discount code down below. The link will give you more of a discount as well. Now, first things first the consoles tomorrow is the day that the new xbox drops now yes this is a playstation channel i do do other stuff as well but i've got to be honest i've pre-ordered the new xbox and i've pre-ordered the new playstation and i'm in the uk so unfortunately even though for a lot of the world the playstation's out this week for me it's not i i have to wait a little bit longer so i am excited to play on the new xbox just to check out next gen graphics and then when the new PlayStation comes, see how they both compare. I'll probably end up doing a video checking them both out and yeah, we'll, we'll deal with that at the time. But there's two new consoles out this week for most of you guys and it's going to be awesome. But the games, it's mostly what we cover on a Monday. Now the first game that I've got to go for is Spider-Man Miles Morales. Now this game just looks epic and if anything... Apart from the gameplay, which does look really cool, I love the lighting effects. On the bridge in the trailer, there was a moment where there was just near lights, and with the ray tracing and stuff, it just looked amazing. Now, I've actually got this one pre-ordered, and I cannot wait to play it. Even though recently I've not really been playing much when it comes to campaign games, I'm thinking when it comes to next-gen console, that's going to change, because the campaign games are where all the best graphics are going to be. Um, multiplayer is going to be pretty cool as well, but yeah, Miles Morales is going to be awesome. The second one that I'm going to go for, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Now, I'm going to stick to what I said a while ago. The OG Assassin's Creeds for me are the best ones. As soon as they kind of mix them up, they changed the way that the game kind of played. Personally, I just preferred the way that it used to be. But Valhalla looks amazing. The fact that it's in, based in two different countries as well, you can come back to England and yeah it's kind of a reminder from when we were playing the um, assassin's creed that was based in london i always get mixed up whether it's unity or syndicate but one of them was based in london one of them were based in france um but yeah valhalla looks pretty cool um i am interested to see how the game kind of changes with next gen obviously we've got the graphical side of things but the gameplay it's going to be absolutely awesome and it's another one that i really cannot wait for but the third and final one that i'm going to mention today is also a game that's free on PlayStation Plus. Now, this game, you guys are going to be able to play it this week if you're based anywhere pretty much but England. Um, and it's a game called Bug Snacks. It just sounds cool, it looks cool, but at the same time, a little bit weird. You're on an island, and like I think you're like a photographer or a journalist or something, and you have to document every single creature. So it kind of reminds me a little bit of Pokemon in the way that you've got to try and capture these creatures, but you've got to use different kind of things for it. On the trailer, there's a point where there's like a burger creature running around, and you have to use ketchup to try and get it and lure it into a place to catch it. And it just looks and sounds really weird. Every creature in the game is also based off a snack, which is where the thing Bug Snacks comes from, I suppose. Um, but it looks so much fun. Uh, graphic wise, considering it's next gen, it doesn't actually look on like the trailer and stuff that good. I will be honest with you. I think obviously it's a smaller game than a lot of the stuff that's coming out on next gen consoles. But either way, the game looks epic and it'll be interesting to see again how it plays on the PlayStation 5. But they're the games that I'm going to go for. Curious to see what you guys think. There's a lot that are being released this week. So obviously there's going to be games that I've missed, not mentioned, and I kind of just wanted to do this video for the top ones that I'm most looking forward to playing. But leave a comment down below, let me know your thoughts. But that's pretty much it for this one. I hope you've enjoyed the video and found it useful. If you have, a like would be awesome. Don't forget to subscribe as well if you do. But thanks for watching guys, and I'll catch you next time.